Hey, we're a little bit worried right now. We haven't seen our cat Mosby. Um, we are pretty sure all that yesterday. Definitely not anytime today. And he is such an adventurous outside, um, you know, cat. We got him at a shelter, and right away he just was not scared of us at all. Wanted to go outside. He's just always been like that. Like we have another um, cat who's only an insect cat, very skittish. We would never even think to let out. But this cat Mosby is just one of those. Wants to be outside, wants to explore. Second here, that's my timer. Um, one sec. Okay, so I'm back. Um, so we're hoping that he's okay, but he's just a very adventurous cat. I've seen him go after big dogs before. He's just the type, just wants to live that sort of a life. But um, Chris just went down to a neighbor, a few down, who kind of has expressed anxiety about him being out before, like worried that he was gonna get hit. And um, he just went there and knocked on our door, but nobody answered. But she's got a bunch of cat rescue stickers all over the front of her house. So really, it's like okay with us if he is in there. We just want to know that he's safe. So hopefully we are saying some prayers that he is okay wherever he is. And that maybe he's just snuggly inside somebody's house, warm on their couch, eating, eating a treat or something. This is one of our standard fall fare that Peter requested, pumpkin baked ziti. So that's all set and ready to go in the oven later tonight. So we thought, okay, the lady down the street must have our cat because she's got a bunch of stickers at her door that say cat rescue and such. So, and so then Christian and I got our nerve up and went over and knocked on the door and we're kind of thinking, okay, like, you know, what are we going to say? Just going to try and play it cool. But she let us in happily and seemed very concerned about Mosby and I think if she had him she would have told us I don't think that she was being deceptive with us so so I guess that Mosby is still out there somewhere so we're hoping and praying that he comes back soon or that he's happy somewhere and safe um, anyway here's the boo boo down there still in his pajamas because it's a Saturday and I got that orange Ottoman off of Craigslist for five dollars. It does have a tiny cigarette burn, which is kind of a bummer, but um, I still like it. And the guy seems like he could really use the five dollars, so I still was happy to buy it. And now Chris and I are going to a bingo night with a bunch of older Dutch people. Yeah, boo boo. That we started going to a couple of years ago. So. Um, the grand prize is a big old hunk of Gouda cheese, so let's home I bring home the cheese.